It's Chandler Cole, the hammer, from Coburn, Virginia, taking on Aaron Bush, undefeated 4-0 from Lancaster, Ohio. Our main event for the vacant Valor Heavyweight title is presented by Ogle, Elrod, and Burrill. Chandler Cole, Aaron Bush, our final fight of the night and should be tons of fireworks in our pro main event. Let's get those fighter introductions. Here is Shamir. All right, here for our main event at Valor Fights 51, I am ecstatic to welcome to the cage, out of the red corner, Aaron Bush. <clears throat> so here's Aaron Bush coming down from Lancaster, Ohio. Team Chaos, the camp for Aaron Bush, four and O, oh, taking on Chandler Cole. What are your thoughts on Bush in this main event? Man, Bush being 25 year old, coming off a win, uh, just June the second, KO finish, 145 in round one in Alliance MMA um, over Chris Beal. He's on a five fight win streak, four of those being professional. Mm -hmm. So he's got a little bit of momentum behind him right now. And um, I'm gonna tell you, at the weigh-ins yesterday, He's an intense guy. He's, an, he's a very intimidating looking guy. And uh, I spoke with him today. Kind hearted guy, great guy, but you can tell he takes this game very serious. At 4 0, you, who hasn't? You know, he, he's got something going for him right now. And as a heavyweight with momentum like that, it is going to put him in the top quick if he can continue that pace. He has not tasted defeat since 2014. Man. As an amateur, that was March 6, 2014. Lost to Tyler Bostic, and that's the only loss of his career because he's five and one as an amateur, four and zero oh as a pro. His pro wins Aaron Bush over Matt Corner. That was a first round minute eight win. Ryan Walls first round a minute fifty seven win. Unanimous decision over Marquise Allen, and then the win that Bubby mentioned first round minute forty five. TKO stoppage over Chris Beal. So. A, a lot of short fights and stoppage via strikes from Aaron Bush, the opponent for Chandler Cole. And Bush is in the cage. And let's go back to Shamir. Now, welcoming his opponent out of the blue corner, Chandler Cole. You hear the reaction for Chandler Cole, the hammer. He is an entertainer. He's a guy that knows his brand and he's been around he competed in the the tough tryouts with yeah. the ufc and he went toe to toe with a lot of those really good guys in those camps uh uh out there but he didn't know why he didn't get picked but he did not yeah, he said he smoked yeah the, you know his, his tryout mm -hmm. and um and i'm pretty sure you know they told him he didn't have enough experience and so, you know, he immediately turns his attention right here to Valor Fights 51, trying to catch, you know, collect this win. And it does look good to fight an undefeated fighter and catch a win over him. It looks really good from here. Um, you know, I, I'm certain he's going to go after bigger and, you know, more, I guess you say more experienced talent to show that he can hang and does belong. But uh, left him a little bit distasteful. Now he's got something to prove. Not to mention, he's got an amazing story behind him as well. Yep. No doubt, he's had a ton of adversity, fights for his grandmother, and he, he's a guy that's overcome a lot and continued to battle through. He's certainly admittedly made mistakes in, in his life, in his time, but he's a great kid, and now his girlfriend's pregnant, so he's thinking about family and moving forward Absolutely. with a lot more besides the fight game. It's a tale of the tape for our main event here tonight at Valor Fights 51. Aaron Bush with the slight advantage in record, undefeated at 4-0, Chandler Cole 3-1 as a pro. Cole, two years younger than Bush, two young guys, and Bush two inches taller than Chandler Cole. Cole weighing in at 262 for this heavyweight bout, while Bush was at 254. 262 is lighter than what we've seen Chandler Cole at times, I think. He is at his best in the 225 to 230 range. He's still effective, though, and we'll see what he's got in our main event here tonight. Back to the cage in Shamir. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here at Valor Fights 51 for your main event of the evening.
this fight is a professional heavyweight division. It is for the Valor Fights title. It is brought to you by Ogle, Elrod, and Burrill. Introducing first, out of the red corner, this professional mixed martial artist represents Team Chaos in Lancaster, Ohio. He weighed in at 254.3 pounds. He holds an impressive, undefeated record of four wins with zero defeats. Let's give a hand for Aaron Bush! His opponent, standing across from him in the blue corner, he is a pro fighter out of Coburn, Virginia, representing Team Fast. He weighed in at 263.5 pounds. He holds a record of three wins with only one loss. Chandler Cole! Your referee for this bout is Jimmy Neely. Jimmy Neely, our referee, we'll hear him. They touch gloves. Chandler Cole, though, absolutely stares two holes through his opponent before every fight. He is amped and ready to go. It's main event time presented by Ogle, Elrod, and Burrill for the vacant Valor Heavyweight Championship in pro MMA at Valor Fights 51. They touch gloves. Aaron Bush in the black and white trunks of red glove tape. Chandler Cole in the black oh, and gray with the nice. blue glove tape. Big overhand right by Cole. Nice jab, lead hook, cut kick coming from Aaron Bush. Low, composed, mm. understands the wrestling. Oh, throwing his own leather back. Oh. God, these guys are coming out swinging. Hashtag bad intentions. Hey, two big guys moving like this. Win or lose, these guys got it right here. Aaron Bush has the advantage on the speed this fight. Throwing some nice crisp jabs. Cole oh. dropped his head, looking for a single leg. See if he can keep it on the feet right here. Like he's cinching up this guillotine like he's trying to pry him loose. I see his underhook right here. Aaron Bush trying to lift up. Oh, Chandler secures the takedown, trying to climb that body. And up comes Bush. Down on the hand, got to watch playing that hand on the mat game. Cole works with Billy Swanson and so many great fighters. So, got to be careful here. Cole is awfully good on the mat. Absolutely. Good display of wrestling. Very agile, especially mm -hmm. as a heavyweight. Fought as light as uh, middleweight yeah. when he was an amateur. Yeah. And, and I, I think he is at his best. And we talked about it yeah, at a lighter weight, but he is still awfully good as a heavyweight here Absolutely. at 260. Absolutely. Being the shorter athlete, he's penetrated the pocket extremely well. Uh, you know, it, it, it can be a detrimental portion of the fight to lay on the underhooks of Aaron Bush, creating, you know, them arms are going to get heavy after the fight if you're having to hold up Chandler Cole, you know, for three three rounds. This is also the first fight for Cole since he went out to California in, in kind of piggyback. Uh -oh. Oh. <laughs> that, that was a home run derby swing I mean, is what that was. Drew that one from Oklahoma. Goodness. Counter over right coming from Chandler Cole in response to the flurry coming from Bush. He's connected behind the ear on Bush two or three times right now. Um, we'll see how much more he can tolerate of it. Cole kind of closing his eyes and blindly. Oh, he a is. back elbow attempt by Cole. Just swinging for the fences. But what I was getting at, Bubby, is he worked out in California. A lot of really accomplished guys, some UFC guys. First time, see if he adds anything to his repertoire after working with those guys. Absolutely. So far, you got Bush right here with the underhook pressed up against the fence uh, on Chandler Cole and winning the head fight right here. Short choppy elbow mm -hmm. coming from Bush. We're listening to his corner. Cole turns him around though. Cole's elevated the underhook. Let's see if Cole starts to split his stance. It's one of the true things you have to do. Otherwise, it's a teeter-totter. It's gonna be a seesaw. You see Bush establish an underhook. They're gonna lift each other. Chandler needs to start working on splitting the stance. Chandler over the top for the overhand, comes out with a nice flurry. 
Got to get a little bit of composure under him. Yeah, Cole should mix in some un, uh, some uh, uppercuts, I think. Everything is kind of looping over the top. Short overhand missing for Bush. Bush definitely got the gloves tattooed on his chest right there, representing mm. boxing quite well. Staying in that pocket, especially like the heavyweights like to do. He's staying in and moving his head, showing his short chopping, reading him. Very mature display of striking right here for Aaron Bush, though. Boy, if one of those connects by Cole, it's 99. Ooh. Five, five minute round, so. Hey, a little bit of agility coming out of Chandler yep. Cole. We don't see that out of too many heavyweights. He wants to show that off. He's got it. <laughs> Catches. Nice sweep. Look out. Oh, straddles him. Tough position right here for Aaron Bush. Cole's on top, looking to put the weight down on him. Yeah. Let's see if he can advance over here. As long as he can keep Aaron Bush's legs away from the fence, he's got a great chance of staying on top and not being cage walked off or bucked off of that sort. Man, when he's on top of you, those are two by fours. Here goes Mount right here. Full Mount uh, has been attained. Up, oh, gives up his back. Oh, yeah. Chandler's on the back trying to flatten him out right here, Vince. Big ground and pound. Normally you don't come back from this right uh -oh. here. Trying to finish the fight, keeping the underhooks. Unanswered. Four, five, six. Let's, how many more can he take before Jimmy Neely steps in? It's coming. Oh. Short trying to finish. Let's off the gas pedal for a second. Big oh, hammer fist man. from Chandler Cole on top, trying to put Aaron Bush out. Bush is not responding, nor is he advancing his position. Oh, it's over. It's over. Chandler Cole secures first round victory, moves on to 4-1 over a game. Aaron Bush. The hammer with the hammer fist to close out the W in our main event of Valor Fights 51. Chandler Cole, C squared. Big damage, and he finishes this fight in the first round over previously undefeated Aaron Bush. What a performance by Chandler Cole. Unreal. Worked the corner by Adam Townsend. Nick Jackson, look at this, flattens him out. You normally don't see the wrestlers get off from here. No coming back from this. Big ground and pound bombs on behalf of Chandler Cole. Aaron Bush, nowhere to go. Only home from here. Man, it's just when he... You could, see, fist. you could see that Bush could hang with him in the stand-up game, but, man, the advantage when he's on top of you, goodness. Unreal. Excellent display. And this will be another great interview <laughs> that Bubby will have because Chandler's a great talker as well. Bush still has been, is not gotten up as of yet, damage done. And Bubby mentioned the uh, Adam Primetime Townsend, uh, among others, in that camp in that corner for Aaron Bush who's still down. He's a little staggered and certainly frustrated. All right, your referee Jimmy Neely stops this fight at four minutes and 48 seconds in the first round for your winner out of the blue corner by TKO Chandler Cole! I'm here with your winner, ladies and gentlemen, Chandler Cole, main event, Valor Heavyweight Champion. How does it feel? It's about time. There was a six foot three ugly guy. He's about 67 years old. Held the heavyweight division up for too long. I said, Tim, don't wait till he gets fit, uh, done or healed up. I want you to find me a tough heavyweight, Aaron. You're tough, man. Hits hard. But I'll always say, champ our contenders talk and champions perform. But legends do both, baby. And that's what I'm trying to do in this sport. So now, A, and your new heavyweight champion of valor, baby, Taylor the Hammer Go! Guys, Chandler, you've been out in California. You got to work with some guys out there. You put on an amazing display of wrestling, threw some heavy heat on the feet. Did you get stunned any, hurt any in the fight? I mean, I'm gonna go ahead and tell you, my training partners out there, they hit hard. So when he hit me, I was like, eh, it's not knockout power. Well, at least I didn't think so. I took it how it was, I threw back, he kicked, I finished, and I beat his head in, in a nice way. Aaron, you're a cool dude, but I won. Ladies and gentlemen, your new 
Valor heavyweight champion right here, moving on to four and one as a professional fighter. Chandler Cole. One more thing. Hey, Dana White, I don't know if you watch Flow Combat, but you need to get me on that contender series if you want the next big thing. Let's put me on that thing, baby! Chandler Cole, ladies and gentlemen.